Oh, you know what? Let me turn my volume up. Let me change my microphone. Is that better? Yes. There we go. Okay. Oop. Okay. You good? How are you doing? Good. Thanks. Good. Ah, hey, Becky. Becky here? She's right down there. Yeah. Okay. Let me turn off the screen sharing for a minute. Hi, Becky. Hi there. I think I need to turn up my volume. How am I sounding to you all? You sound clear to me. Mm -hmm. You sound really good. How about me? Yeah, okay. Hi. Hi, Deb. Hi, Kate. Hey. Hi, hi, hi. Thank you for making time to have this happen today. Appreciate oh. the opportunity. Well, I really want to talk about this drive through food drive. It's so exciting for us to be able to meet together like this, talk about the food drive tomorrow, and talk about the benefits that are going to happen from the community involvement. And what I'd like to do is, after this is over, turn around and share this video with the communities with the links to um, the lists, which I'll convert to, to photos so they're viewable um, across our social media channels and get some chatter going. I was hoping today to have mastered StreamYard so we could actually do a Facebook Live with all three of us on the screen. Oh, and, and I'm glad you're, <laughs> I think I'm glad maybe you weren't quite there yet. <laughs> <laughs> well, you know I what? I, be saying, this is why I keep wearing a hat. <laughs> well, you know, can, can I just tell you, the hat's darling. And oh, okay. It really is. And I don't think any of us at this point really need to be too concerned about what we look like because it's what's in our heart. And we, we really, and you know, I don't know anybody that does, you know, that goes the extra mile every single day and now are, you know, ramping up the, the pace like you are. And I just, I just want more of us to know, and this is a perfect time to actually share this video this evening to give people an opportunity to be prepared to drive, know exactly where they're going to drive over what the address is, how they can just drop it off between 10 and 2. It's 10 and 2, correct? 10 and 4? 10 and 4. 10 and 4, which is even better. And I know a lot of moms are going to want to get away from their Zoom calls. <laughs> 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 they, they're going to want to actually leave. So, so, Becky, I was hoping you could tell us a little bit about the impact because, you know, thank God for Christensen Realty who saw the need, has stepped forward, and this is what community is all about, is seeing, you know, where can we make a positive difference for our people here in this area? You know, Rancho Penasquitas is a very, is very, you know, it's, it's huge. But to hear that you're doing 1,700 food Yeah, I think, I think it'll, be, it'll be more this month. That was 1,700 just from April 1st to April 30th. Wow. Uh, before COVID, the normal was more like 750 households. Okay. So 1,700 households, that's not really even people, that's households. So okay. um, what we're running into um, is we've always kind of known there are families that need help out there that don't necessarily qualify for right. some assistance programs. Right. And a lot of those families might be in subsidized housing it, within the region of the school district, uh -huh. but it's just not enough for them to, to live um, without dipping into reserves at any time. I, you know, obviously, whatever the statistics were before COVID, 30% or so of, of people don't really have any savings, but um, we're not talking about those those people right now. This this pandemic with the closures has affected many different types of people. And yes, yes, we, and it, it the demographics for your services. I'm sure at the end of this COVID, um, you know, whoever knows when that'll be, uh, is the face will look completely different. 
I mean, I know in my industry, nobody's worked for two months. Yeah, right. So there's no income. And this, right. this uh, subsidy or, you know, they haven't received any resources that are promised. And they don't qualify for, um, you know, they're independent contractors. So they only qualify for what the state has allotted for that. And so their, their finances, they are, the food scarcity is a reality. Yeah, it sure is. And um, it just is. I think the increase that we have seen has probably a good part of it has come from independent contractors who are now not able to work and not able to receive any stimulus checks or benefits of any sort. Needless to say, we've always um, had a large referral of single parents on mm -hmm. our list mm -hmm. and um, they remain on the list as well. But we don't really expect people to give us more than just a little bit of information. We're open to helping anyone who really needs food. That's right. how we start. That's how friends and family community connection starts. And right now, um, acquiring food has become such a challenge. Acquiring yep. food to share. We have some wonderful resources in place already gardens that grow for us through the Backyard Produce pro Project, school gardens that grow for us, tree picking. Okay, we've got some produce coming to us still because of that. But we used to also get fresh foods from grocery stores and it's called food rescue. When you go and pick mm -hmm. up from them, the things that they think they cannot sell that day. Right, right. Um, that is so minimal now. That's very scarce uh, that, they're, that they have much for us. Yeah. And so whenever that happens, when you're low on your fresh foods, you want to rely on your pantry foods even more to help people yes. with you know, your pasta, your rice, your peanut butter, your canned tuna and cereal. And we've been going through that so fast. It's, it's phenomenal how many bags we've packed and have been out in, in people's homes. And the list of referrals is so large that we're only able to help most families just once every month or once every three weeks. Mm -hmm. And some of those people really need it more frequently. So we're here to also offer referrals to them, you know, and see what else might, um, we might be able to do. So the so food drive by Keller Williams Red Day is perfect timing for us right now. I know it's going to help a lot. Well, we're, we're going to rally. <clears throat> the Penasquitas Town Council is here to support the community um, and has been the community hub for a long time. And we want to elevate your visibility, your need, and support our community partners doing their part. We couldn't do it without you, Deb. Christensen Realty yeah. has made a huge, is, is really you know, a trailblazer in um, identifying a need and rallying the, the community together. And so we just salute you and we'll do everything we can, Becky, to, to get the word out that you can have, you can look at the list that we're going to add today to the, to this thread Okay. will be a list of uh, supplies needed that'll make a difference in the pantry. And this is just a safe food drop-off, everybody. It's just right. a safe food drop-off. You don't have to get out of your car, the, pop the trunk. It'll be grabbed out. You, you won't touch anybody. So it'll be, a, it'll be a safe way to make a difference for those of us in the community who want to know and want to help and really don't know how. Right. So this is an opportunity. And that's not to say that friends and family um, doesn't do this on a regular basis. We, we acknowledge that you are out there every single day, every single week, helping those that fall between the cracks. Mm -hmm. and and what, if I, if I might ahead. add, Kate, too, just to let those who aren't aware, Becky volunteers up to 60 to 80 hours per week. This is a volunteer position and she heads the local, um, you know, the local community efforts here within the Poway Unified School District and nearby communities. 
So this is something that, she, like you said, she does on a daily every day. Every day, yes. as a volunteer. Yes, so thank, touched. Thank, you. <laughs> thank you. Crazy. Thank you. Really, thank you. So you know what? Thank you for being, thank you for being you. And if some people call that crazy, we need more of that. Yeah, we, we sure that's kindness, that's sympathy, that's compassion and good works. And we, yeah. we just, you know, hats off to all of those parents who are struggling, people that are falling through the cracks and knowing that there's an earth angel out there who's saying, you know, we can do better. And so right. I think to know better is to do better. And so, you know, we can all do our part mm -hmm. to support you making that connection. So I just, go ahead. You know, along with Becky are, are many other volunteers. You know, oh, yes, volunteers, yes, yes, yes. You know, on a weekly, monthly basis. So mm -hmm. to those people who do that on a regular basis, too, we want to, you know, absolutely and say thank you and for the difference that they are making in so many people's lives. You know, uh, single parents, young families, even seniors who are struggling. So, you know, it's a wide variety of needs that they meet uh, on a regular basis. Yes. So this so, drive through. So so I know many people in in our circle of the town council who were constantly circulating um, collections throughout the different neighborhoods in Rancho Penasquitas right. to make a difference for friends and family. Um, this, is, this is an opportunity to acknowledge Becky, but that also means that whole umbrella of our friends and neighbors that step into this as well. So right. this message is today to say, the rest of the neighborhood who, who may not know, right? Everybody's got a busy life, so they don't know. They're, they're just got their head down and doing the best they can. But when they do hear, they want to contribute. And this is a way for them to fill a bag, get a gift card. You know, it's from 10 to 4 tomorrow in a drop-off safe way. Yes, and so let me give you the details. Um, I mean, I'm going to put this out. Can, am I, is it? It's visible. <laughs> It's visible. 13400 Saber Springs Parkway in Saber Springs, right off the 56 and the I-15, the Keller Williams North Inland Office. It's a very simple, easy uh, drop off, as you, as you said, Kate. People just drive into that driveway. They'll be led to where to go. Stay in your car, pop open that trunk or your uh, back end of your car. And one of our Keller Williams associates will remove the donated items, drive around the parking lot and exit the same way you came in. Very simple. All of us at Keller Williams, all of the associates will be wearing masks, gloves, and we'll be social distancing. So we are going to be, you know, putting into effect the CDC's health directives. We're going to be safe for you and for ourselves. And we really do look forward to uh, collecting as much as we can for the friends and family community connection, for the families who are struggling with food insecurities, and also to let you know they are also accepting monetary uh, donations. Okay, so, make so that's, that's, that was my next question. So, next, so mm -hmm. tomorrow's a big day, tomorrow's a big opportunity for the community, but friends and family works 365 days a year, and you are clearly up to big things so we want to make sure and put that link for those who may not be able to come tomorrow but they may want to they may not want to donate okay. yeah. so you know we'll put up that link for donations as well like you know very there are some people that are working not that many but those that are who still want to participate we're going to make it easy for them as well to to get involved to Thank make you. that donation. We would appreciate that. We do have a PayPal option on our website. Okay, great. I, I, someone said to me uh, the other day, yeah, I don't have paper checks anymore, so I can't write a check. <laughs> I'm an oldie, but a goodie, I hope. So I just like, oh, I forgot. Yeah, my kids don't even have checks either. <laughs> you know, so. it, it, is, it, is a, it, it is a tool that we're used to, but you can, you know, you have a, even if you have a debit card, you don't have to have a credit card. You can go ahead and make a deposit right there through mm -hmm. PayPal. And you don't even have to use PayPal. They give you the option. Do you want to use a PayPal account? If you don't have a PayPal account, it's okay. They'll take your debit card. Yeah. So it's so 
it's so user friendly that um, every little bit makes a difference from five dollars to five hundred dollars whatever whatever you you feel called to contribute and maybe you want to do a monthly donation food insecurity is uh, something most of us uh, I think when this whole thing started it was that was a reality that was a reality for the first time that oh my gosh I may have something here now but there's no guarantee that they're going to have the deliveries continue with any regularity and I can tell you after talking to the distribution centers nothing's the way it was there's right. no regular delivery at the grocery store there's no there's no guaranteed driver from the distribution centers uh, mm -hmm. So there's a lot of weak links in what we're doing. So the fact that we do have backyard growers and maybe some local ranchers that may not be participating who've been crunched may, you know, they may have freezer options that we can connect you with that would allow a protein product to go in there as well. That is, that is still, we would know. love, we would love a commercial address with uh, cold storage that we could access yeah we but we need to get in and out of it quickly you know we're not yeah. putting stuff yeah, away those are those are bigger conversations to be yeah. had but there are but i know three ranchers locally that um could probably get a tax write-off for for being a partner mm -hmm. that'd be awesome so i do want to say one more thing about um financial donations because friends and family community connection also does other projects, uh, including international work. Uh -huh. If someone feels led to financially donate to us, we ask them to put a memo or make a notation on okay. PayPal that is for local families or for the COVID um, Collection. period or what, you know, something like that okay. should be added on. So that's mm -hmm. really good to know. So everybody that's donating, I want you to turn around and make a, make a note on whatever you're purchasing, your intent. So if you feel compelled to, you know, do a monthly donation for COVID or you want to do any of the other programs that are available on the website, you get a chance to look through all that. Um, but tomorrow's our big, our big push and our big day to, to really fine tune what we've got going on here and make it very user friendly and easy on Keller Williams Red Day. Is it Red Letter Day or? It's Red Day. It's Red, Red Day. Yes. Let me give you a little bit of history, if you don't mind, Kate, on that. Every year, Keller Williams Associates across the world um, take one day, and it's always the second Thursday in May, to give back to their local community. So this year, the, Cal the Keller Williams San Diego North Inland Office in Paper Spring is um, their, our day of community service is benefiting friends and family food. Um, Friends and Family Community Connection, excuse me. Got it. <laughs> yes. And uh, so we're really excited. We're all out there wearing our red shirt and uh, renewing, energizing, and donating for that day. Well, that's, you know, I, I've been involved with your projects in the past, and it's always very moving and inspiring to, to see good works in, in action. Yeah. So. So I just want everybody in Rancho Penasquitas, the Penasquitas Town Council is supporting our community partners fundraiser and giving back day to friends and family community, community connections. Very good, thank you. We're, yes. we're really so, grateful. So this is, if there's anything else you guys wanna say, please add it to the Facebook post because this is gonna be posted shortly as soon as it uploads, you know, um, I just want to say thank you to Zoom for not doing anything wonky today. <laughs> so we'll get this spread across next door. We'll get it, we'll, you know, we'll just sh share and, you know, with the intent that people are moved enough to take 15 minutes and drive over and drop off some supplies for our friends and family in our community. It will make a big difference. Yeah. Absolutely. Absolutely. Truly yeah. speak for the people that we're helping. Yeah. They're just so grateful. And yeah. I do want to acknowledge all of the volunteers, all of the oh, volunteers God. that help yeah, your organization. Yeah, there's a on our list that's yes. been working lately. Yeah. yeah. So we, our hats are off to them because it, you know, it's it takes it takes a, a community to strengthen a community mm -hmm. and lift really up a community. Does. So. And, and Becky, I have to tell you. Um, 
uh, the associates there at Keller Williams San Diego North Inland are so excited to be a part of this project. We have been waiting, you know, for this day in great anticipation, knowing that this is going to um, serve a lot of people and help a lot of people and um, and benefit your organization, so it can benefit so many others. Oh, so, I'm I'm glad to hear the enthusiasm is catching. <laughs> it is very excited. Enthusiasm. So, ladies, I, if there's nothing else today, we're gonna get we're gonna get this out and share the message and um, let good things happen. Appreciate it very much. Yeah, Kate thank you, and Deb. You're welcome. Yeah, thank, you. thank you guys yeah. for making this work. Yeah, Sounds thank good. you. And well, we'll do our best to try to follow up with some notes or photos. We we have a terrible habit of not taking photos because. Of, we're, our hands are so busy already. But we'll, well I've we'll put some it. feelers out. So I think I think there may be photographers and there may be um, other sources out there that are going to um, bring attention to all the good works that are happening tomorrow. Wonderful. I couldn't okay. ask for more. Thank you both. Okay, so until next time, ladies, thank you very much for your time and, and God bless you and all that you're doing. Blessings to you too. Okay. Bye, Bye for now. Okay. Take care. Bye. Bye. Thank you.